everybody, welcome to another Money Reviews. Today we're checking out these straps here from Spiritus System. These are the Spiritus version 2 fat straps in M81 Woodland. And these are a very, very nice low profile H harness strap system. And I like them a lot. These were sent with some other stuff from a viewer. I was kind of happy to get these because I have checked out the knockoffs. I have not had the real ones yet. So it was very nice to compare the two. And Spiritus, as I figured, just feels better. The stitching is good. It's robust in all the areas you want it to be. This panel is so very heavily sewn in place on the outside of the strap. As you can see, there is no PALS webbing. There's no one inch on here. It is all laser cut. So they have a laser cut section of Cordura that is heavily sewn on here in order to sit over the buckle and then retain PTTs or strobes or whatever you need on your strap. I like the fact that they had included these small little cutouts right there, 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 all down. That's good for putting shock cord through to help retain things. So I think that's kind of a nice touch. The straps are not padded at all, which I actually also kind of like. They're, they're wide and thin and flat, meaning they will play very well with running either a pack over them or just uh, staying low low profile and not very cumbersome in your way. They're, they're definitely made to be, to be worn underneath pack straps. The bulkier your straps are, the thicker they are, the more hot spots you're going to get when wearing a, a pack of some type. You have nice stitching back here to hold the rear adjustment strap. You have color matched one inch webbing all the way through with black hardware. I think the black hardware actually is a nice accentuation to M81, more so than green or even tan hardware. Tan would probably look okay, but I just think black looks great. It's just, just got that older, like 90s vibe to it. It is finished off with a male buckle. You have a good amount of extra space to work with here. All in, I'll get this as far as I can before I think it would slip. I think that's as far as you could go without slipping. Without any, without slippage, and you are sitting at 23 inches of strap to play with. I, would, I don't know if I'd back out this far personally. I'd probably, I'd probably go into like the 22 or 21 inch point and then tape that in place. If you have to max it out to here, I will let you know you are running the risk of losing your buckle because one little extra slip or loosening and you're screwed. So keep that in mind for your my larger humans or wearing this over bulky winter gear. You do have a little tri-glide back here for keeping of your strap. There is no elastic or anything attached to this as well. So that is all you've got. You just have the tri-glide. So tape will be necessary to police your slack and your slop. You have a loop field on the back of the H as well as Spiritus's tag right there. So you know it's the real deal, it's Spiritus Systems. And then you have a color match loop field on the back of the H. I have a Axle Industries laser cut flag. I can't remember the nomenclature for this thing. Oh, ooh, yeah, I can't, hold on. It's the, um, oh, never mind. It just says American flag patch size two Ranger green. There's a specific name for these on Axle's website. I'll have a link down below if you want to check one of these out. They're pretty cool. I wish I could remember the exact name, uh, name of it. But either way, nice little flags. I dig them. On the other side, you have the same thing. Same color match webbing, same D-ring, same male buckle. I believe these to be Duraflex, but I can't be 100% certain. Let's see if I can get this buckle out of here. i tell you. That doesn't say. They're nice buckles, though. They're high quality. They're not going to bust on you easily. Uh, actually, let's see if this is a uh, repair buckle. It is not. So it's a sewn-in captured buckle. It's not a repair buckle. So if the buckle does break, you will have to cut it off. But it would be easy to add a repair buckle to this bit of webbing back here. So that's kind of cool. Overall, nice set of straps. I like them. Again, the hi highlights that I like, I like the fact that they're low profile. They are going to be nice under a pack. I like the fact that they've got this laser cut field here now that is going to allow you to put push to talks rubber bands are in here. It's just going to be a lot easier to work with. And shot cord. You could loop it through, overhand knot it, boom, and I have like a little keeper for your PTTs. Spiritus definitely put a lot of thought into this, and I'm, I'm glad they did. 
anyway, that's all I got, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you got something out of this review. Not a crazy big review or a long one. Just an overview of these straps. And say they're a big plus. I would go for them. If you're looking for straps for your chest rig that aren't padded, these are the guys to get. Anyway, as always, get out there, man. Play some airsoft. LARP smarter, not harder. I'll see you in the field. Peace.